can only show you the door. You have to walk through it. Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we'll be taking a look at an altcoin Solana, ranked 9 on coin market cap. Solana in the last one month has traded for as low as $19. It has also traded for as high as $25. The altcoin market is on the edge. All coins are down heavily in the last one month. Are we going to dump to Goblin Town for the rest of May? We have been waiting to see how low we are going to dump in this bear market. All coins are currently going through a bear market. And even though I've seen some pumps to the upside, we have also seen huge dumps to the downside. We have seen Solana go from as high as $250. We have seen Solana dump to Goblin Town in its first full crypto bear market. So how low can we go in the coming days and the coming weeks? We'll be looking at key levels where Solana might find support. Also looking at Solana's performance against Ethereum and Bitcoin. And we'll take a sneak peek at Solana's market cap. It's down below $10 billion. Can we rally above the $10 billion region? Or are we going to see Solana dump into Goblin Town? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, an investment in knowledge pays the best interest when it comes to investing. Nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. Do the necessary research, study, and analysis before making any investment decision. Let's get down to business. Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So all coins have been dumping to Goblin Town. We have seen huge, huge dumps in the altcoin market in the last one week, even in the last one month. A lot of all coins that said 2023 on a very bright note have seen double digit losses in the last one month but we're going to continue dumping to goblin town are we visiting the lows where we got to in the end of 2022 because guys we saw ethereum dumping to goblin town going below one thousand dollars we saw bitcoin getting to as low as fifteen thousand dollars that was down down to goblin town from their bull market prices in the case of Solana, Solana was one of the biggest gainers in the previous bull market. Solana getting to as high as $254 printed a lot of millionaires. When cryptocurrencies, things can go very, very quickly from pumping to the moon to dumping to Goblin Town. And since 2021, Solana has been a graveyard. Since 2021, Solana has gone down more than 96% from its all-time high. The last two months have seen Solana holding a very critical price level. We started the year on a very bright note. We saw Solana giving us around a 167% pump to the upside. But since February of 2023, guys, we have been seeing Solana consolidating and moving sideways. Now, it's either we're gearing up to pump to higher prices or we're going to see one big fat dump to Goblin Town. Solana has been ranging for around 123 days. We have seen it dump 32% back to Goblin Town. We have not been able to rally above the $27 region. Now, that $27 region is a very, very critical level for Solana. We have seen Solana hold support at that level in June of 2022, finally breaking below the $27 level by November of 2022. And we have been getting rejected. We have tried to blast above that $27 level multiple times. If we see a dump in the market, if we see Bitcoin and Ethereum dumping to Goblin Town, if we see a dump in the altcoin market in the next one week, guys, crazy things might happen to Solana. We might see a huge dump to Goblin Town. I will not be shocked to see Solana drop into as low as $15. Hopefully, we'll find support at that level. Hopefully, $15 will give us the support we have been looking for. If not, guys, there's always that possibility that the bear market bottom might not be in for Solana. There's always that possibility that we might still see Solana dropping even to as low as $10. When we go to $10 the first time, a lot of people do not believe we can go that low. But after FTX collapsed, after we saw FTT going to nearly zero, we saw Solana going from as high as $38 in November of 2022, dropping to as low as $8 by December of 2022. We saw Solana dropping by 79% in a 54-day period. And it can happen again. 2023 might be shaping up to be that year of consolidation. I believe we're closer to the bear market bottom than we are to the top. But your number one job in the bear market is to survive. 
and things can easily get crazy in the bear market. If you take a look at what Solana did before we started this bear market, huge, huge pumps to the bull market. The same way we didn't continue pumping forever, at some point in time, the bull market came to an end. I believe at some point in time, the bear market will also come to an end. We saw Solana from April of 2020 trading around the $0.5 level, rallying up to as high as $250, pumping to higher prices, giving us almost a 50,000% pump to the upside. It took around 567 days for that to happen. Right now, Solana is going through its first full crypto bear market. We have been in the bear market for around 550 days. So Solana has been in existence for over 1,100 days, and half of it has been in the bull market, half of it has been in a bear market. And this bear market might just be coming to an end, but guys, the final phases of the bear market are always the most important. That's the best time to accumulate more if you're going to be here for the long haul, if you're getting ready for the next crypto bull run. When the market is at the most bearish level, that's when smart investors are accumulating. And right now, a lot of whales are currently buying deep in the bear market as we're getting ready for another crypto bull run. And if you're among those whales, if you're among those smart investors that are nibbling, accumulating all coins carefully in the bear market, remember guys not to go all in too quickly. There's always going to be opportunities down the stretch. The bear market is full of opportunities going all too quickly. Even though at some point in time it might look smart, but over the long haul, if those opportunities come your way and you're not able to take advantage of them, you will not be happy. So better to have some capital on the side so that no matter what happens, you can take advantage of that opportunity. Taking a look at some key details about Solana in its first full crypto bear market, the last one year has seen Solana trade for as high as $58. It has also traded for as low as $8.14. Currently, Solana has a market cap of $8.5 billion, a fully directed market cap of around $11.5 billion, and over 1.7 million people have Solana on their watch list on CoinMarketCap. If you want to buy some Solana in this bear market, if you are quietly accumulating Solana and you want to get some on your favorite crypto exchange, you can get it on Binance, on Coinbase Exchange, on Kraken, on Qcoin, on BitTop, on BitPhoenix, on Bitstamp, and guys, anywhere you get your popular altcoins. Now, how is Solana performing against Bitcoin and against Ethereum? If you are holding any altcoin through the bear market, you want to also pay attention to how it's faring against the two biggest cryptocurrencies in the crypto market. Now, Solana had huge pumps against both Bitcoin and Ethereum in the bull market, as expected. All coins are known to do very, very well in the bull market. But in the bear market, even though the whole market is dumping to Goblin Town, all coins dump way, way harder than Bitcoin. All coins dump way harder than Ethereum. And in this bear market, we have seen Solana lose more than 88% of its value. Yes, we have seen some pumps to the upside, but guys, we have still set lower highs and we can easily continue dumping to Goblin Town. History has shown us over time that a lot of smart investors run away from all coins when the market gets overheated because in the bear market, why will I be holding all coins and holding more rigs when the whole market will be dumping to Goblin Town? So if you take a look at Solana's performance against Ethereum, you will see that Solana has had huge, huge dumps to the downside. But even where we're trading right now deep in the bear market, Solana is still up around 1,200% from the all-time low against Ethereum. Against Bitcoin, Solana is also up more than 1,000% from the lows. Guys, even though when we're expecting Solana to dump to lower prices in the coming days and the coming weeks, that might happen against Bitcoin, that might happen against Ethereum. And we take a look at Solana's market cap. Still trading above the $5 billion region, but in this bear market, we have seen Solana's market cap drop to as low as $2.9 billion. That was 27th of December 2022. In the coming days and the coming weeks, if Solana starts dumping to Goblin Town, as a lot of market participants are predicting, key levels I'll be watching out for for Solana's market cap, we bounced to as low as the $6 billion level, but that was way back in March. We found support there. If we don't find support at the $6 billion level, guys, we'll be heading back to the $3 billion region. And from where Solana is trading right now, for us dumping back to the $3 billion region, we see Solana dumping, dumping by around 63%. What will the 63% dump do for the price of Solana right now? From the $21.3 region, we will see Solana dumping with 63% to new all-time lows in this bear market. Solana will go to as low 
at seven dollars are you still going to be buying for dumb that low drop your thoughts about that in the comment section thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this turn on the post notification to get notified anytime i drop a new video and anytime i go live remember guys invest for the long haul don't get too scared don't get too greedy see you guys in my next video remember all i'm offering is the truth nothing more